Hello everyone. So today we will discuss about visual force space. So what is visual force? Visual force is a framework that allows developers to build sophisticated custom user interface that can be hosted natively on the Lightning platform. It is a tag-based markup language which is similar to HTML. The visual force space consists of two primary elements. One is Markov and second one is controller. Visual force Markov. So visual force Markov consists of visual force tags, HTML, JavaScript, or any other web enable code embedded within a single Apex space tag. Then visual force controller. The visual force controller specifies what happens when a user interacts with the components which is specified in an associated visual force markup. So the behavior part of the page comes under the controller and the looking field or appearance comes under the markup. The visual force controller is two types. One is standard and another one is custom. So if you want to use the custom controller, then you have to write one separate Apex class for that. So let's do an example. We will create one form using visual force space. In your org upon the developer console. So to create one visual force space, you need to click on file, then new. Then visual force page. Name it as demo visual force. You click on OK. So the page will look like this. I already created. one form for that so i am here using standard controller and my object is contact here i am using the apex form tag the apex form component is used to create forms in visual for space um, the apex input and output components are added inside apex form component then apex page block the Apex page block component will create a block in the page to create styles similar to cells for detail page. Here the title is create contact. Then Apex page block buttons. The page block buttons component is used to create set of buttons on page block component. Here we are using save and cancel button. Then Apex page block section. Uh, this component is used to create sections within a page block to categorize different fields into different sections. Then Apex input field. The input field tag is used to insert Salesforce objects like standard and custom objects. So after writing the code, you need to save it. Then click here the preview button. This is the UI page. Now you need to create some records. So the last thing will be so see. Here choose any lead source. I'm choosing here is web and give any phone number. That field is also there. So here you can search um, for the accounts which are related to contacts. Here I'm choosing test. Now save this. 
after saving the records will automatically show in the record page let's go to the details so here you can see the name is susri phone number my account name is test email field and lead source is web so this is all about the form creation in visual force thank you